Hello viewers, welcome back to my channel. I hope you are well and doing good. Today's recipe is Kima Alu Matar. You will need the following ingredients. 500 grams of minced lamb, 4 to 5 potatoes into cubes, half a cup of yogurt, 1 cup of peas, about 3 to 4 green chilies, 4 medium sized tomatoes which I have sliced up, 1 teaspoon of salt which is to your taste, 1 teaspoon of cumin powder, half a teaspoon of turmeric, one star anise, a couple of cinnamon sticks, two large cardamoms, half a teaspoon chili powder, one and a half teaspoon of coriander powder, one teaspoon of cumin, one tablespoon of kasuri methi, three to four green chilies, one teaspoon of garlic, one teaspoon of ginger, about two large onions sliced, coriander as we need it, half a cup of oil. In a pan, add a half a cup of oil, Add the whole spices, fry this for about 20 seconds, add the cumin seeds, fry this for 20 seconds, add the onions, now add the ginger and garlic paste, saute that for about a minute, now add the lamb mince. This has been sauteing for about 8 to 10 minutes. Now I'm going to add my spices. Let this saute for 5 minutes, then we'll add the tomatoes. Add the tomatoes. Cook until the tomatoes are nice and soft. I'm just going to put the lid on to help the tomatoes soften up. The tomatoes are slightly softened up. Now I'm going to add the green chilies. Now I'm going to add kasuri methi. Just put it in your hand and just crush it together. Add the peas. And after about a couple of minutes, I'll be adding the potatoes. Add one cup of water. I'm going to add some more water later on. I'm just going to cover this for five minutes. After about five minutes, I'm going to add the yogurt. I'm going to cook this on a medium to low heat until the potatoes are nice and soft. Do stir in between if needed. This has been cooking for about seven minutes. If you needed to add more water, you can. Now this is the time you can check how much gravy you want. So I'm gonna add a bit more water. Some people like it dry, some people like it with a bit of gravy, but I like it might a bit with gravy in there. So now I'm going to let this simmer for about 10 minutes. Just cover on a low to medium heat. This has been cooking for about 8 to 10 minutes. Now I'm going to add the coriander. I'm also going to add these chilies. Let this simmer on a low heat for about 5 to 7 minutes. Kima alu mutter is now ready. You can serve this with chapatis, naans or whatever you prefer. I hope you've enjoyed my recipe. If you have, please like, share and subscribe. We look forward to seeing you again with a new recipe. Thank you for watching.